thing here, Miro. Yeah. So F3, give me your knight. He's done it. Knight takes, what a turnaround in this game because... Uh, Not only that, but King F7, wow. F3, Knight F3, King F7 is even stronger. Not Knight F3, what? King F7. To King stop Bishop F7. E7. Oh, to stop, okay. So I wanted to say Knight takes B3, Bishop E7, and he's done it. King F7, stopping the one source of counterplay you had, which was Bishop D7. Uh, delayed gratification. <laughs> nice. Knight takes b3. Deal with it. How, how can I deal with that? What am I going to do? Um, do I have any king e5, knight takes e5 check ideas? Very, very doubtful. Mm. No? Very doubtful. What else can I do? Yeah, King F7, such a lovely move, just kills all of White's mm -hmm. ideas. You know, I was looking at knight takes e5 and then d6. Right. Come, can't, can't do that now after King F7. Exactly. And You'll you cannot King defend e6. the pawn on b3. Uh, last chance saloon here. Um, Miro, King F5, knight takes b3, knight takes e5, check. D I, I'm desperate. King takes. But it also feels like knight to d2. Ooh. Knight to d2. Uh, b -b 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 -b. <laughs> and b3 uh, is coming. Here. Yeah, I'm going to take on. Take yes. And now you don't even have to worry about this one anymore. No. Nope. Because you've got knight b6. So that looks like a winner. You got it. Wow. Um, it's incredible. It's a terrible turnaround Risky. when you think about uh, how bad uh, an opening position Fabi had. Uh, the worst check Benoni I can ever recall and in modern. He just drops his bishop down to g3. Any chances with sacrificing a piece on e5? It, it's, he's, it, he's going to he's have gonna... to because there's no choice. Otherwise, the b-pawn was just going to run up the board. Fabi says, I don't believe you. And Ferruja says, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I don't believe myself either, but I gotta try. Uh, Miro, that this is probably winning in a number of ways. King e8, yeah. king e7, king f6. It's hard to, hard to suggest a move which does not win. That was my question. Yeah, because your king is in check. Otherwise, I would suggest a blunder bishop or something. <laughs> but your king is in check, so I think any you legal can move, blunder your king. Any okay, legal I, I, move I, I wins. I can find yeah. a way to blunder. Okay, king to e7. Yep, it's a good move. d6. D6. Now, I'm, I might and win the bishop. You've blundered. But I, <laughs> I have allowed black to promote the pawn. Yeah, right. Knight to d4. And does, does it move the knight anywhere? Even. And then you cannot stop the pawn from promoting. That's harsh, even when I fall into your trap. And uh, we do see king e7 played. Even when I fall into your trap, I win. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, but ultimately this position is lost. Exactly. You cannot salvage this one. No. I think probably the best is to go drop the knight back to d3, at least prevent the b-pawn from promoting. Okay, knight to d3, and maybe in that case, yeah, you can knight just... c1, knight takes b3, knight takes c5, sorry, b3. That's yeah. a weird line. I give three connected pass pawns, but my minor pieces will quickly uh, blockade them and yep. they'll be lost. Well, that was quite the flurry there by Gukesh and Daniel. I think Gukesh was fortunate to win that uh, in that time scramble at the very end. It kind of felt like a tennis match, didn't it? If, <laughs> like if Daniel had played kept... Bishop takes B5, yeah. Remember when that knight c3 fork? Yes. That would have been a cold shower moment for sure. Mm -hmm. Bishop takes b5. With the move bishop takes b5, was Daniel better? Yep. Yes, he that's was. what I thought. 
he was. And let's not forget the, what's happened in this game. Uh, would Firuja play a4? Yes, and just shut things down. I mean, then never get... would have had a chance to, <laughs> no. to get to anything remotely close. Looking. Not at yeah. all. It Not was just a all. kind of a blip in the system for Ali Reza. You know, but Bishop takes g5, kind of underestimating the opponent's counter chances. Honestly, if you think of it, I think he, he's gotten few critical moments wrong in this position. Mm. Did, or, uh, rather in this game, and even like when he played Queen F3, allowing F5, possibly was the last chance. Right. Bishop E3. Fabi is uh, prepping the move Knight to D2. He defends the uh, pawn on C5. Once his knight moves out of the way, then it's the B pawn express. E5, Knight D2. We would expect. And you're the white knight play, can't move. Yeah, you're welcome to play d6 check. I will just either blockade it or step up. So um, e5, knight d2, king to f5. Uh, I'm taking a pawn. That looks very, very strong. No, no, no problems d6. here. D6 check. I'm not even giving up my knight yet. I know. <laughs> King F6. King F6. Yep. Okay. We have a handshake and Fabiana Caruana beats Ali Reza with the black wow. pieces. But it was quite the eventful <laughs> game. Indeed. We were talking about the uh, decisive uh, numbers there, 40%. Two out of five, two wins.